Hi, I'm Guy Manthill, Technical Product Manager for Canal Insulation. We're going to follow the installation of two methods. Firstly, a double layer system that uses a 110mm initial layer and a 180mm second layer. And secondly, the install of an R7 single layer system. It's important to note that the system has a design density to enable the product to knit around the timbers, pipes and cables. This is without any need for any notching. The system creates a continuous layer with no thermal bridging. We're also going to demonstrate two methods of treating the perimeter. Firstly, the use of an uncompressed perimeter bat, and secondly, the R7 product being compressed into the eaves using a perimeter barrier. This method maintains the separation and ventilation requirements and means that you only have to use one insulation product. Here's an example of the uncompressed perimeter bat being installed to maintain the required 25mm separation. The product has a thermal value designed to comply with the H1 EVE requirements. The product is manufactured at 110mm to fit into the eaves without the need for a barrier. Depending on the location of the roofing batten, you may need to trim a section over the top plate to maintain the ventilation from the eaves. Here's an example of the R7 being compressed into the eaves using a perimeter barrier. Okay, so here we are at the end of the demonstration. We've successfully installed the R7 single layer and the double layer system. My choice would be the single layer. The secondary layer is really difficult to get into place and guarantee a full tight fit of all the joints put in together. Um, and anything that gets in the way I'm dragging it through and then fighting to get it over and between any joists. Where with the single, I can just push it right the way through. It fills either side, covers everything. Both methods achieved H1 compliance. However, as expected, the single layer was faster and was preferred by the installer. Both systems can use either the perimeter bat or the barrier to achieve compliance at the eaves.